Yeah, I want to highlight these two pieces too. A little extra line yap. This is showing some of those installation skills Mark always showed from when we were young. Get a close up on these. Innovation. These innovative installations. Blew my mind when I first saw you doing that stuff, man. You see, this piece is for Katrina? Yeah. This is actually the anniversary of Katrina, you know, a few days ago. They got the new documentary out, Katrina Babies and all that. I'll look for it. It's mm -hmm. going to be on Netscape. Or Netflix. It's on the uh, HBO. HBO. It's on the HBO. Uh -huh. yeah, I'm sure of it. I mean, there's so much here in this so studio. That's made from garbage. So I was out at the Petrified Forest working as a park ranger one summer, a couple summers. And I didn't have the heart to throw my garbage, especially when you, fe you feel the, the air and the soil and everything of the natural environment. You're like, the last thing I want to do is leave any plastic or tin cans. So I would take containers, uh, cups, anything I had. This studio is a little bit like a maze. Hey. <laughs> All these different places. Yeah, well, they're like stations. I think of it like Montessori, right? Mm -hmm. Like the kids go to different stations. Like that's the ball. Got the there. print and press. Uh, I get this in here. This might be still a little wet. That was the thing I had to do for uh, Ukraine. It was, you know, I get aggravated watching the news. So. This is cathartic when I can get something out, although it's been rejected for two shows already. I don't know why nobody wants to touch it. Don't worry about it. It's going to find its place. Yeah, well, even if it doesn't, I got it out of my system. Mm -hmm. On to the next thing. But see, it becomes a problem. This dude has got, like, the mothership connection up in here, man. <laughs> so what happened was, when I retired from teaching full-time, uh -huh. I never watched television. Right. And I got hooked on the Doctor Who series. Right. right? So after watching all those Doctor Whos from, like, the time when I was maybe not a tiny kid to up to the more recent, I, gotta, I ain't got to redesign my office to reflect what happens in here. You Man, know. you need to have the the city of Chicago needs to come up in here and, and re oh, record this. Yeah, man, it's awesome. like reality TV and a treasure, <laughs> hidden treasures. Nobody knows this is in here, man. And of course, uh, I've got my guardian who watches my back, Barack. Okay. Finally, yeah. What's going on with the hand right here? Yeah. Oh, uh, this was this piece was called. I so one most of my stuff I find in the alley. Right. This was a plastic chair that's shaped like a hand. Yeah. And I screwed plates of steel overlapping each plate, like almost like a like a turtle shell, um, creating a skin over the whole thing, and then put like an oil rig that was rusting but it I call the piece greed so the the giant hand represents the, uh, you know the fossil fuel industry and and their greed for uh, drilling as kind of a I don't know David and Goliath thing but their days are numbered it's just the way it goes you know 